I hear you in there whining. I wish you'd be quiet. Every time I get ready to make a video, you start screaming. Good morning, family. I got to really take my time with this one. Uh oh. Because uh, I don't want you guys to take this the wrong way. Um, but actually, it's only one way to take it. It's things that make you go, hmm. And I'm always one that looks at the underneath, underlying cause of why we do things. You just got to get underneath the damn thing. You know, it's never what you see on the surface. And this is what, um, you know, even, you know, working with people, working through therapy, working through uh, situations and um, giving advice, being able to deal with families, working with families um, that are extremely dysfunctional. I had, I had to learn how to get underneath the thing, okay, because things are usually not what you see on the surface. So that brings me to the conversation about Mr. Uh, Nick Cannon. Um, and the conversation with Nick Cannon is not just because he's he said that he was going to be celibate and now he's in, impregnated somebody else for his eighth child with his, what, seventh baby mama or something. So not or, you know, not not just that. But it just amazes me that you have all these so-called woke, I'm woke, woke, I'm wearing my turban, I'm a black man waving the red, black and green and all this stuff. And But every one of your baby mamas look white. Now, I, I, don't, I don't mean to be disrespectful at all, but I have a problem with that. I got a problem with all all this pro black talk. Everything you talk about is black this and sovereign this and this that and the other. And every woman, none of them look like your mama. None of them. So either you hate your mama, it would have it would have seemed. I mean, this is what it would appear. You would hate the color of your mama. You wish your mama looked different. And so in turn, you maybe you wish you looked different. You said you had a problem being skinny, but now I'm worried about did you ever have that you can think of people making you feel like you can't have no dark woman? Because I noticed that you went with Jessica White. She said you impregnated her too. But that was kept so hush hush that nobody really basically knew you were dating her. And are you using this wilding out? format to be like Harvey Weinstein? I'm, I'm just asking. These are all legitimate questions. And do the whores flock to a wild and out because they know that all they got to do is lay down with Nick Cannon if they light bright and damn near white and get a baby for him? Is that what we doing now? That's how this go. Because it's certainly what it looks like. I mean, I, I you know, I want to see you with a brown, a woman that looks your color, and I'm not gonna see none like that. All the babies you make are white, half white, or babies that look, uh, uh you know, and and take that damn turban off your head. <laughs> Put on. I mean, for real, and I mean. Okay, I done went a little bit too far. You can wear the turban still. But that's something that you need to examine. I don't understand why you keep on talking black this and black that. And I frankly wish you quit. And every time I turn around, you got a white one. Or, or somebody that looks more white than ethnic that you having a kid with. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Damn that. So I don't care if no I don't I don't care if nobody see that. If you don't, you need to clear the scales from your eyes and look at this behavior because they don't match. The behaviors don't match what's coming out of his mouth. 
the what what come out of his mouth, he should have the prettiest, blackest uh, woman uh, that you ever want to see with some green eyes. I mean, they come all we come in all kinds of exotic looks now. But yours always white looking. Mm -mm. Okay, like I said, I had to get that off my chest today. Um, I like to know what y'all think. All right, tell me. Leave your comment below. If you like what you hear, please like and subscribe and please share. Uh, YouTube has, I believe, cut off my notifications. So if you get notifications, you're being lucky. They're playing with my subscribers. But it's okay because I'm playing with a platform. So I, I realize to whom much is given, much is required. Uh, it's they shit. I'm not going to complain about it. But I know what y'all doing out there, YouTube. Cause I, I, you know, this this fluctuating of my uh uh uh, 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 subscribers and supporters is is just a little bit messed up now. Okay, so and I'm seeing the dirty work. They dropping off, dropping off by the hundreds and by the thousands, and then they come back by the twenties and the twenty. Uh uh. But that's okay. If you haven't, if I haven't reminded you before, hit the notification button, um, and hit all and on the little bell. And that way you'll be notified every time I drop a video. I appreciate you being out there. I appreciate you for supporting the channel. And um, I'll see you in the next video. Tell me what you think about Nick.